Good morning. I'd like to introduce myself. I am Miss Kristen. I am the proud co-director of The Family Room in Amherst. Today, I'm gonna to take you on a little tour of our facility at the Harlem Road Community Center. And we're gonna show you how you can come in, check us out, and become a member while getting a little tour of our awesome indoor playroom as well as our outdoor playground. So join me. We've got a first mask up. Those are the rules. So we can go in to check out the family room. The family room is located at the Harlem Road Community Center at 4255 Harlem Road in Amherst. Once a school, it has now been transformed into an awesome community center for families in Amherst and Western New York. Lots of groups utilize here, but the family room is located right on the main floor and here's the way you can get to us. We're going to take a little stroll from the parking lot to our back door, which is our main entrance, and we will be entering and exiting through that entrance only. The building is still closed to the public, but can be accessed by appointment. As we walk up to the family room doors, you will notice there is not just one, but two fantastic playgrounds here at the Harlem Road Community Center. The playground right ahead of us is designed for children, school age, five years to age 12, and lovely green space, trees for shade. And then you'll see our toddler playground, which is located right outside of our entrance, is designed for children 18 months up to age five. We recently had a new surface installed, which is squishy, comfy, and safe. Family Room had a part in designing this toddler playground so that it was age appropriate for our participants. Isn't it fun? Here is our entrance to the Family Room. You can utilize the ramp with your strollers or use the steps to come on up. You'll see we have some of our ride-on toys put out for kids to play on the playground. Let's go! As you enter, a staff will greet you, ask you a few simple questions, have you initial, then you'll sanitize and come into the room. Dun, da, da, da. Into the family room we go. You'll notice there's also a sanitizing station here, as well as the sanitizer on the table. We make sure that everybody washes their hands before coming to play. And welcome to the family room. We have our staff, Ms. Shelley, and we have some friends today with Reagan and Addison, and of course our ambassador, <laughs> Ms. Brittany. You will also notice that the kids and adults are wearing masks. We are required to wear masks for children two years and up at all times and encourage the social distancing as well. So as you come around our facility, we have it broken into learning centers. Over in here, we call it our dramatic play. Basically, we have our house, a little food truck, the kitchen, a couple of dress-up costumes that are washed and sanitized in between, and some play space as well. Here is our art center. We have our four-man easel, which we are using two to keep six feet distance, as well as a little table. Everything is spaced safely apart. We do have a bathroom located right in the room, which houses a changing table. We provide sanitizing, and we have diaper pail. The bathroom is cleaned after each use. And of course, there are reminders to wash those hands. Hi, Miss Lily. What are you making today? I'm just painting. You're just painting? And what are you using to paint with? A sickle. Yes, <laughs> these are called watercolors. And are you making a special card for Labor Day? Yeah. Yes, we call it our labor of love and making 
thank you cards to our essential workers. Can we open it up? I love what you're doing so far. Can you open it up and see what it says inside? Ready? <gasps> what does that say? I don't know. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, so you're going to paint and then you're going to, oh, we've got some stickers too, right? You're doing a great job. Can you give me a thumbs up? <laughs> Our Tiny Tots area is very safe for littles to stop in and play. And they have their own toys to play with as well. Our lovely arched reading area houses some of our favorite stories as well as a cozy area to sit and read together. On the other side of the arch, <laughs> thank you, Miss Annie. On the other side of the side of the arch, you will find puzzles and learning games. Our busy builders area obviously has an awesome roadway rug, our Duplos, a, an old fashioned race car mountain. We have magnet board. And again, with our busy builders, blocks in which to construct, excellent for steam and STEM activity. And then our array of Fisher Price toys, including the tool bench, everybody can be handy here. In this area, we also have what we call our hands-on exploration station. A lot of fine motor, cognitive, and hands-on activities that are interactive for kids to learn while they're playing. The family room also offers weekly activities and what we call our pop-up field trips. We are doing weekly themes, which next week will be a touch of fall. Ooh, sounds interesting, doesn't it? Following week, all about apples, and guess what? That will be followed by a field trip to Becker Farms. We'll also meet some llamas at the Hem Street Farm Llamas in East Aurora. Take a little stroll through Glen Park, do an activity there. Ah, and our annual favorite of visiting Stigelmeyer Park where we will meet, do a little nature hike, play on the playground and feed the animals too. You can find this calendar of activities online at www.amherstyouthandrec.org. It is also posted on the Friends of the Family Room Facebook, Facebook page, as well as the Family Room Amherst, New York on Instagram. The Family Room sends out monthly newsletters to all of our members and we also post it on our Friends of the Family Room Facebook page and the Family Room Amherst, New York on Instagram. It's going to highlight all of our activities, our open door hours, give you little tools and rules to the room, especially during these times. Two pages will highlight all the information you need for that month, including our pop-up field trip details, contact information, and information regarding um, your membership. For more information about how to become a member, our hours of operation, and membership fees, please visit www.amherstyouthandrec.org. There is a link there that says family room information that will take you right to all of the info provided here. joining us on our little tour of the family room. We look forward to seeing you soon to come and play. If you have questions, please feel free to email me at knorton at amherst.ny.us. You can also reach us at 631-7218 and the website, which is www.amherstyouthandrec.com 
www.thepeopleshow.org. We are really looking forward to having new friends join us and old friends return as well. And just a reminder, we are following all guidelines and keeping it safe, educational, and fun for families. And we're looking forward to seeing you soon. Take care. Thanks for joining us.